Hey Scorpio, how's it going? Welcome back. And for those of you that are new, I am so grateful you're here. My name is Sam. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I just realized these cards are flipped over. We are going to do a timeless love reading. Um, when you feel drawn to the title and to the picture and the messages within this reading are resonating for you, that's when it's meant for you to hear. It's going to be completely no contact type of really, um, reading. Someone brand new entering your life, those of you that are single and wondering what's coming towards you, maybe you're manifesting someone specific into your life. So I'm going to pull from multiple decks, even characteristics of this person, maybe even your characteristics come through. Um, so take what resonates. Remember, it's not a one-to-one, -one, but there will be multiple messages for you to receive within this, your rising, your moon, and your Venus placement also. Scorpio, I am giving away two free personal readings. Most of you are aware. If you are new, go ahead and subscribe so you can take part in my monthly giveaways. Um, for this month, new and returning subscribers, leave the word grateful down below in the comment section of this reading and any reading you view of mine throughout the month of November. Very last couple days of each month, and it's a different giveaway each month, very last couple days of each month, I remind everyone to pay attention to that little bell top right hand corner of everyone's YouTube homepage. Like I said, two people will be hearing from me. December is going to be multiple love readings that I give away. All right, for my Scorpios, who is coming towards Scorpio? Spiritual connection. Your spiritual partner. Very honest, trustworthy connection. Something coming in very balanced. Libra energy showing up. So this is unconditional love. This is someone who wants to stick around through good, through bad, through tough through, you know, challenging situations. Someone who's going to, you know, it's like your partner. You want to bit bring the best out of, you bring the best out of each other. No looking back. You are moving forward and you're only getting excited for what the future holds. This is you finally letting go of specific things of your past. You're bringing peace and harmony into your life. But somebody is coming towards you very, they're ready to be very emotionally expressive. May like sports, may love basketball. This person is very independent. Aries energy. It actually says Aries rising. So you may even have Aries rising. Very action and goal oriented. For some of you, this person's coming in sooner than you anticipate. I'm getting like very strong air energy here, like wanting to rush in, wanting to take action towards you, sweep you off your feet. I'm sorry for my vacuum. My fiance is vacuuming. And believe me, I do, I'm not going to tell him to stop because I love the fact that he's vacuuming. Look at this. Secrets being lifted. Someone coming in being very observant of you. Someone who's ready to explore the unknown with you. I'm going for my Scorpios. Yeah, they are taking charge. They may come in calm, cool, and collected, but you make them very nervous, Scorpio. For those of you that have spent some time completely alone, that is coming to an end. Both of you are very independent, though. You both have your solid foundation separately. And there's judgment getting ready for this brand new beginning divine favor blessing from the universe total transformation of you and what's coming towards you it's like you are ready to wipe clean the slate and start fresh i love this for you all right let's get characteristics 
I have darker hair. Like I said, athletic build, maybe into sports. Some of you could be dealing with a dancer because this person is definitely like ballet or something. We have April. So I'm going to say from now until the spring, but we will pull specific cards of timing. Um, so it could be an Aries, could be a Taurus. March. So it's looking more like the very beginning of 2025. Darker hair. Did I not just say I see darker hair, dark hair, dark eyes, fine lines. Facial hair. May, yeah. I'm going to say from now, within the first, from now, 2024, November 2024, until like the very first few months of 2025. Let's see. And medium skin. Bottom of the deck is glasses. All right, let's get deeper. Seven of Wands, worth waiting for, ready to put the fight in, ready to go the distance, ready to get through any challenging times. Six of Earth, this is a cosmic gift from the universe. This is an equal give and take. Like I said, this person coming through wants to stick around for the challenges, but it's like you bring out the best in each other. Ten of Swords, so it could be ten days, ten weeks, ten months, but a completion of a chapter here. And there it is, something coming in balanced, something coming in fair. For those of you looking for long-term commitment, possibly moving into one with, moving in with one another, um, marriage. Proposal and marriage I'm picking up on. Three of Pentacles is at the bottom. So you may meet this person by doing business with them, by working with them. But this is what they desire. They desire long term. For those of you a little bit older, meeting your partner. Because remember, I do have fine lines. So meeting your partner. But definitely a completion of the cycle is bringing this in. Remember, you're not looking back. You're letting go. Ten of Swords, completion. All right, let's see what else. The Five of Wands. The Seven of Swords. <clears throat> the Hermit. The Eight of Wands, Strength. I have to say, Scorpio, I feel that there is someone who's crushing on you already. Someone who has, like I said, a crush or deeper feelings for you than they are letting on. Someone who's overcoming fear and anxiety and will be approaching you. Cupid's Arrows, the Eight of Wands. This is communication coming in. And like I said, the two of you together, it's such a strong power couple. A brand new chapter in your love life. Let's see. Spirit, why is the six of earth here with the seven of swords? Yeah, there it is. You're done. You're done with people hurting you. You're done with people confusing you. You're done, you're done with those people that make you question 
um, their intentions or their ulterior motives. This is such growth within yourself. This is why you're ready for this, Scorpio. Bottom of the deck, the sun. Spirit is saying, no need to worry. Your true partner is on their way to you. And like I said, for some of you, this person is already crushing on you. All right. Spirit, can I please have a timeline for this person entering Scorpio's life? Timeline for this person. All right. For some, we've got April coming through twice. Yeah. In November. So I'm going to say from very soon, which would be now, because I know we're closing out November, until November of 2025. So within this year, from the time of this reading, which is November 2024, until November 2025, by your birthday, this amazing birth, your next birthday season, 2025, this person is coming towards you. Signs I have are Aries, Taurus, Pisces, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, Leo, Virgo, Scorpio. So take it how it resonates. And then we have Capricorn here and Taurus. All right, so I'm going to pull Scrabble tiles. Look for your initials. You may even want to screenshot this and the, per the person that comes towards you next, their initials, you, you can resort back to this. We have L, O, K, S, I, Z, R. All right, take what resonates. Leave the word grateful down below. Anytime you want me to tune into just your energy to inform you on who's coming towards you, um, I do have a singles reading, but I have multiple readings in my Etsy shop. They're currently all on, well, most of them are on sale. Um, the cyber sale through Etsy will be ending the first week in December. And I, like I've said, I'm running out of availability on these readings. So if you're looking for a personal reading, now's the time to take advantage of the sale. December is going to go to only emergency readings in my Etsy shop. But then, in, you know, the very last week of December, I'm going to open it completely back up. Um, but yeah, so much love and light, Scorpio.